This person... Wandering around the Great Desert is asking for trouble. A lot of it. There's a reason Zion makes a point of banishing its criminals. Still, something is strange about this. Who or what could have done this? Probably a Nativa. Or maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Guess it doesn't really matter either way. That's true, but in any case, it says the data chips were flown away using drones. I'll search the area. I expected as much. These people risked their lives for this. I'm not sure what they were thinking. Well... Whatever they were thinking, not everything is black and white. It's all open to interpretation. Well, there's nothing more to investigate. Hey, if we're heading back, why don't we visit that restaurant again? It's possible we could have missed something. What's an angel doing here? How are you involved? I know those people never made it back from the Great Desert. I see. So that's what happened. The truth can never be concealed. Have you not noticed something's wrong with Oracle? People settle for order and feign ignorance. What do you mean? Are you sure everything you believe is true, Angel? That is all I can say. But remember, next time, you might end up in our shoes. Precious treasure. Mother Sphere's blessings mean nothing to me. I'm all about treasure. this ransacking my shop for the tenth time I'm not selling anything to you hmm. wait a second 
Yeah, that's right. You're an angel. <laughs> Why didn't I think of that before? What is it? Do you know what's most important in this blasted city? Hmm. Resources. Yes, resources. Energy, to be precise. People like us don't dare siphon enough energy from the city. The only way for us to do that would be to find something on our own to use. And the point is? There's an old distribution system in the Great Desert. A hypertube, was it? Anyway, it's not a place us folks can simply waltz into. One wrong move, and you'll never make it out alive. But something's definitely there. An energy source, like a fusion cell or hypercell, maybe. Angel, you can do it, right? You could retrieve the treasure from the hypertube. You help me, I help you, and we help Zion. Do this, and we're all good. All good? <laughs> Looks to me like you're the only one coming out ahead here. Huh? Adam, it's not a half bad idea to go there. Come back to the tetrapod at any time for maintenance. This must be it. Okay, let's jump in, shall we? Tube is cut off. Looks like it was destroyed during the colony extinction. Not to mention there isn't half as much cargo as I expected. I'd be surprised if anything's still intact. I'll take a look around. Thank you. 
this a fusion cell? It is an old fusion cell. <laughs> what a surprise. Really? Is it intact? Oh, it's a little beat up, but we can still use it. Okay then, that's great. What? My goodness. So there really was an energy source. G give it to me, Angel. Now, we had an agreement. You're supposed to give it to me. An angel shouldn't lie. Give it to me. Do you hear yourself? How can you be so entitled? Ave, there's a fusion drive at the back of the store. Strange, isn't it? Wait, wait, you, you can't just... Come on. Let's find out what's really going on. What's this? Well... You see, she's my wife. She died a long time ago. Your wife? Then you should have said so. How could I? I wasn't about to take any chances. Not that it mattered in the end. Well, that's all there is to it, Angel. I may talk big, but I'm still only human. Well, I guess he's not such a bad guy after all, huh? You can have the fusion cell. Oh, okay. Thank you, Angel. Oh, sister, it's you. I hope your day has been peaceful. As for myself, I'm being plagued with agonizing thoughts. Oh yeah? What's wrong? Well, I believe mother is testing me. As I told you before, I thought my shameful brother's fate had been sealed. But I never imagined I'd be given news about him from a scavenger. You're saying he's alive? Yes, sister. Or rather, he was last seen alive. Life is a blessing from Mother Sphere and the Network, and I am forever grateful for this. But my brother Felix has become a sinner. This sacrilege I cannot just forgive and forget. But only Mother can judge and punish. Sister, no scavenger can find missing people while evading the monsters of the Great Desert. You are my only hope, Angel. Please. Well, all right. I've already involved myself in this. Oh, Mother Sphere. You have given someone in need a ray of hope. I will send you the location data I purchased. May Mother guide you.
Come back to the tetrapod and... So, Francis's brother was hiding in these ruins. It isn't that unusual, Eve. But, I guess it is pretty remarkable to have survived this long, coming from 807. Let's just deal with the fanatical brothers and be on our way. Okay. What does this mean? The voice of truth. I'll consider it. He left coordinates. Well, I suppose we'd better follow him.
half buried under the sand. <laughs> I gotta hand it to him. How did a cultist even find this in the first place? This voice brought him all the way here. Whose voice could it have been? Whoever it was, they must have been pretty easy on the eyes. It says he went to Abyss Le Foire. I'll track him down.
This person. It's hard to imagine someone in their right mind saying that. It's all mumbo jumbo, but I gotta admit, I respect that determination. Wait, there's something here. squad use this recording device you're right let me check this is no good the data's corrupted yeah and here I thought we'd found something useful well I guess this is it let's get going we still need to report back to Francis okay may your memories live on forever Welcome, sister. May Mother Sphere bless you. Do you have good news? I wish I did. Here. Felix's memory stick. No. What happened? It seems Felix was wandering through the Great Desert. Convinced he'd heard the voice of truth. He claimed that Mother Sphere was no god, and that he heard, saw, and felt the truth. I'm not sure if he had lost his mind, or if he was after something. It's a miracle I found his body. It cannot be. It might have been better if none of this had been revealed. He was mad. The words of a madman cannot be considered blasphemy. But... Why did Mother Sphere let Felix suffer such torment? And if Felix was indeed mad, then... Why would I come up in his last moment? Oh... Mother... Master of all knowledge... Why have you tasked me with such trials? Please... Forgive Felix. Please... Forgive me. As I pray... Let there be light again. Let there be light again. jump from here, I'll die. Is this better? To die like this? Or become some Natiba's dinner on the journey to the Oasis? What should I do? Hey, stop thinking so negatively. What's going on? <gasps> Angel! <sighs> I'm so sorry about this. I wasn't actually going to jump. How embarrassing. What's the matter? Angel? Have you ever been in love? What? Uh, love? I... I was in love once. Truly in love. There was no storm we could not weather as long as we had each other. Along our journey, we were attacked by a Natiba, somewhere in the desert on the way to Zion. 
He was just trying to protect me, but... <sighs> his corpse, it... It sunk into the depths of the oasis. Like a fool, I ran away alone, and... I left him there, there, in the cold water. I was wrong. I shouldn't have done what I did. The guilt eats away at me day after day. I couldn't do anything else but cry and cry. Leaving Zion, it was just too dangerous to imagine. You do what anyone else does. You find a way to make it on your own. Well... That's what I thought at the time, too. But what's the point in living anymore if I can't have him? The memory stick might be damaged. It was in the water for a long time. It's all right. Even if the memories really are lost, if I just had something to remember him by... I'll search near the oasis. Really? I can't believe it! Thank you! If you can do that for me, I'll forever be in your debt. Thank you so much! There's no guarantee that I'll be able to find him. Don't get your hopes up. Come back to the tetrapod at any time for maintenance. What happened here? The person Beatrice is looking for must be somewhere nearby. very deep but this corpse doesn't look like it was attacked by an atiba no it looks like he was attacked from behind with a blade while running away maybe enough to find it. However... Oh, thank goodness! Please, give it back to me! Yes, here. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> huh? oh, my baby. You finally made it back home to me. <laughs> It's unfortunate the memory was also badly damaged. 
Don't fret. No matter what you are, I'll always love you. Forever. Hey, Beatrice, right? Are you sure it was an Atiba that did it? Angel, is that you? I didn't know you were still here. Why are you asking the obvious? Do you... Are you doubting me? That trace... It doesn't seem as though Enetiba was responsible. You weren't there, Angel. You weren't there. I was. My baby was killed by Enetiba. I saw it with my own eyes. I saw it. Uh, I'll pay you, just like I promised. But I'd appreciate it if you didn't say such foolish things. Let's get out of here. Somewhere else. Where we won't be interrupted. I'll be able to see just what kind of information is passing through. A fair? At the wasteland?
Hip <laughs> 